So, how long does a fight have to go on for? That's, a, that's quite a big question. Uh, it all depends on what you do and how you react in the first instance, okay? Now, you see some fights with some you know, unexperienced fighters. They're just swinging and they're just all over the place, falling on the floor, kicking each other in the face, then getting up, swinging some more until one of them might catch that lucky one on the temple and knocks the person out. You see that a lot. But we don't want to do that, especially I'm getting older. My cardio level ain't as great as it was, you know. Um, so I don't want to be rolling around on the floor. Also, once you're on the floor and you're rolling around, you get hurt. You're scraping your you know, you're hitting on the concrete, your head on the concrete, scraping up your elbows or your knees, we don't want that. So I want to, at the first instance, I want to go boom. I want to get in there. Uh, again, it's like a reality check. I want to try and get this person down first, okay? And what do we do? Obviously, you put everything into that first strike, okay? So what we're looking at is, there's your opponent, he's got his, he might have his guard up, he might be threatening. Again, I'm a big believer in the uh, the first strike, okay, preemptive strike, okay. If someone's threatening me or mentioning that they're going to kill me or they have a weapon, then I'm going to hit them. I'm not going to wait. You know, they told me I'm going to kill you. I've got a weapon, so I'm, I'm, going to, I'm not going to wait for it. I'm, I'm going to. I'm, I'll hit them first. Again, it's a preemptive strike. I was put in fear for my safety, so I've defended myself, and you can get away with that. Yeah, obviously, don't kill the person. You know, you do what you can to defend yourself and get out of that situation, get out of the area and go, get home safe. So again, back to what I was saying, you know, when we try and you want to hit this person first. Now, a lot of the time when we're, when we're in our starts, we don't go, ah, again, I'm always saying this, don't put your hands up like this. One, you look like an idiot. And two, you're just heightening the, the, the tension. You're heightening this person's anger to want to hit you. And it plus it makes you look like the aggressor. Why do that? Yeah. Okay, so I've always got my hands up here anyway, but it's more in like an interview starts where I'm like talking, I'm trying to calm the person down. I'm, you know, uh, keeping my hands up here, but they're here for a reason in case that strike does come through and I have to block it. Or if I'm going to throw my preemptive strike. Now, my preemptive strike is going to come from here. Obviously, my lead hand, yeah. I'm a big believer in a palm strike as well, okay? Because uh, um, when you punch, it's too, you're too tense. Uh, you can damage your, your knuckles, you can miss, you know, but a palm strike is nice, it's right in the face. Yeah, you're definitely gonna get that. And plus a palm strike, as well as strike, you're pushing straight through. So I'm not gonna hit the person here, I'm aiming for the wall behind that person, okay? So from here, again, it comes from the back foot, and the power comes straight through, okay? So from here, it'll be like, you know, sorry, calm down or whatever. You know, he's still getting aggressive. So from here, I'm just with, right through there, yeah? My palm is going into the nose. I can get my fingers in his eyes, disorientate, make his eyes water, cause confusion so this person can't hit me back. Yeah, so from here, again, if I'm in this stance, I'm gonna hit with a rear hand. Again, it's coming from the back, Foot, so from here, ish, okay, straight through. As you can see, boom, my body moves. I'm not just standing there going, eh, eh, stroking his face, giving him a little caress in his cheeks. No, it's ah, ah, straight through, okay? From here, ah, yes. Now, if that ain't enough, ah, I'm gonna stick on there, boom, and then this one comes through. Again, remain tactile, so when this goes, boom, stay on there, grab an ear, ah, Yes? Eesh. We're coming straight through. Eesh. Yes? Straight off. Go first. Preemptive strike. Okay? That's what that is. Now, believe me, trust me, if this palm hits that person's nose, my fingers are going straight into his eyes and I'm pushing him straight back and then before he knows it, the secondary one is coming through. Wait. Right. He's either going to be on the floor or he's going to back up and he's going to say, enough. Yeah? He might come back at me with some swingy hooks or whatever, but I'm already in here. So from here, boom, I can grab him. I'm gonna go to town, yeah? I can get him in the headlock, yeah? Get him in the front, but 
I've initially come straight through push, with this. Push. Yes? Push. I love that strike. Again, palm strike can come from all angles. Yes? So that was the thrusting one. Now, I can come along the side like a slapping motion. Yeah? Now, you see some guys when they, a lot of guys do use a slap again this part of the hand, straight into the side of the temple, into the ear, on the jaw, from here, it's got your hand straight through. But a lot of the time, I don't want to swing out like this. Yeah, so I want to keep it compact. So from here, again, I can throw my, my, my straight palms, straight palms right through, I come here. As I'm here, I'm still twisting. That comes through, yes? From here, ish. I'll turn my hips this way, yes? Yeah, straight through. Again, ish. it's more with the palm strikes as well as striking, you're pushing straight through. Creating damage, creating confusion. You get hit in the ear, that's the, your hearing gone. You get gouged in the eyes, that's your sight, okay? So not only are we striking, we're attacking the senses, yeah? We're creating confusion, we're creating disorientation, disorientation, which puts us to the advantage of getting away, yeah? And then this person is gonna back off or give up, okay? So that's what we want, it's not about, bah, bah, yeah, come on in there, uh, step it back. No, I'm not up for that. I'm here, big shot again, straight through, fish, fish, fish. I want to finish it there and then, okay? Thank you for watching. I hope that makes sense. I think that's my pass, uh, my, uh, what can I say, my trademark line now. I hope it makes sense, because I always say that. But I hope it does. I hope it makes sense. I'm trying to keep it real, okay? Because out there, it's not a movie. It's not a computer game. It's reality. People want to hurt you, okay? So you have to hurt them first and get home safe to your family. So guys, keep watching, subscribe, follow my channels, no nonsense combat. Look after yourselves, look after each other. Take care.